Hello guys, so I am Mangesh. So from today I will be regularly up uploading my videos on this mainframe channel. So we will see some utilities uh, in deep uh, in details. So you might have seen my basic videos in that I have already explained how this mainframe works. Uh, what are the utilities? What are the concepts are associated with this mainframe? How important mainframe is? What is what level of security that mainframe has provided? And that is the reason why till that this mainframe has there in market some bankings and retail industries are mostly using the mainframe because of the security. Okay. So today we will see what is the IP generous utility used in mainframe. Actually, it is a very important utility that is used in mainframe. So uh, some of uh, might have heard this utility just used to copy the data set from one data set to another data set. What it does actually, it just copied the data present in this data set to this data set. You might have heard this because this is the basic uh, use of IB general. But I will tell you there are sometimes uh, some uh, applications use that uh, uh, data set, but its format is tape. So sometimes the format of that data set is tape. Okay, so tape is a format. If you, you use tape format in mainframe, then you cannot see the record length and you cannot see a basic information about that data set and you cannot open that data set because its format is tape. So sometimes we have to find uh, open that. It is our need to open to see that data. Sometimes we need to see that what is the record length of that data set so that we cannot do because of tape so we have to first convert it in a normal fb files a bit data set and there we can check so for that purpose as well we are using ib jenner okay so ib jenner is a utility that we uh, use to copy from tape data set to fb data set so that we can open it and uh, see the information and data inside that data set so ccut1 so in ccut1 you have to give dsn so you have to give whatever the data set you want to copy or you want to uh, like open so you have to give that input data set name in ccut1 ddsn name and its disposition should can be disposition can be share or old okay and in ccut2 you have to give the data set name uh, that is not present in your catalog you have to give any data set name random data set name uh, actually you are going to create uh, it is a new data set you will, you will be creating in your mainframe catalog uh, you can see after running the job you can see this uh, one data set with his name uh, in your data set and it the data will be exactly same like this and its record length and everything will be same like this okay uh, its record length and all will be same like this so you can directly refer if you want to see the record length and whatever the parameters of the data set you can directly refer this data set okay because it is uh, simple so you can uh, easily check and disposition should be new catalog uh, new catalog delete or new keep delete okay it can be anything uh, new catalog delete is also fine so dcb is equal to asterisk okay what does it mean uh, normally you guys uh, might give that dcb in dcb parameter you can give record length block size for record format right so that is also one uh, concept uh, that is also one way to give dcb but here i give dcb is equal to asterisk so it is it is uh, like a modern modern way to give dcbc what does it mean asterisk dot ccut1 uh, it means that record the parameters for this uh, data set you can use exactly same parameters like the input data set okay ccut whatever the parameters used for ccut1 you can 
uh, used or you can uh, allocate the same parameters to our data set okay output data set so it will allocate if the record format of this file is 50 then it will be it will be going to it will create a new data set having uh, name this and having a record length 50 okay this is what uh, that uh, line meaning okay and unit is equal to sysdar actually it is a uh, memory that you know right volume volume is this so space space is equal to cycle 110 so you have to give space cylinder so we are using cylinder and this is the primary quantity 100 and secondary you know primary and secondary all this i have already explained very well in my basic videos if you don't see that video if you didn't see that video you should go through that video first then only you can understand this and sysprint is equal to this system is equal to this csin is equal to dummy so this is the basic program so this is copy this is the commented line okay this is the comment in mainframe jcl we give comment if you have to give comment if you have to give the description of that utility you can directly say to copy from one data set to other this is some description we give generally for our purpose okay it is not a necessary as you know the meaning of comment it is just to have some idea about whatever we are coding okay so this is also one uh, comment uh, if you see these two lines these two lines are actually out of the these two lines are called as job card okay and job card uh, this can be anything and uh, actually these are the parameter you can give anything notify is equal to ampersand ccud means those person who will going to submit whose id uh, whose id they, they sh sh should get the notification that if uh, the job failed somehow if we miss something instead of dot if you comma then there should be some a message should be come so notify is equal to ccud it means uh, to the those person who will submit the job whose id should get uh, that notification whether the job got successful or not after copying after pasting this code in your ps file and saving it you can just give submit on your command prompt and submit it you will get max is 0 100 percent uh, but make sure that this dc this para this data set should be exist okay like it should be present in your catalog that is the more important thing if it is not exist then ha, what you will copy nothing right okay thanks guys so i am planning to upload some videos from today definitely i will work uh, you guys should share this video subscribe the channel and yeah be in family if you have any doubt you can comment it down uh, if you think that uh, some if you have some uh, feedbacks you can give uh, it, it is always been uh, it is always uh, good to give feedback if you really like this uh, videos use your feedback in comments like share and subscribe okay thanks guys thank you okay bye